Is the online job application process a black hole? Should I be applying more online or spending more time networking? If these are the things that make you anxious, then hang on, I'm going to speak through my personal experience. For those of you who don't know my background, I was an international graduate student in the US and I'm going to share a few things that really worked out well when it comes to getting more responses through online application. Let me start with a personal fact check. Three out of four jobs that I've held so far were through online applications. I have received several responses um, from small companies, let's say less than 1000 employees and all the way to large companies with more than 50,000 employees. When I was looking for my internship, I had the same question in mind. Hundreds of applications submitted every week and hundreds of rejection emails, which sounded like a automated email. Yes, it made me think whether they are even looking at my application. And one might think startups probably don't get as many applications as a large firm would. And so they end up looking at all the application personally, unlike large firms. But I'll tell you, over the years, I've noticed that's not necessarily true. It often feels like the whole world is conspiring against you, but that's not true. Everyone has a problem to problem of their own to deal with. And trust me, the hiring team is equally exhausted in finding the right candidate for their roles. So what do we do? I think we should start by understanding the system, right? Now, given the system, there are two possibilities. One, either your resume got parsed by your bot, or it got scanned by a person. If the application did not make its way through, most likely it's because the resume was not a great fit. Now, it's important to note here that the resume is not a good fit. It's not about you, it's about the resume at this point. First things first, stop seeing these rejection emails as a reflection of your abilities as a professional. So for online applications, remember the two important considerations. One, the job description itself, and second, your resume. Yes, you should definitely apply online. Spend a lot of time applying online. If you're thinking this is something that rarely works, drop that thought right now. I'm a live example. Most likely, it's your resume that needs work, and that's exactly what I did to improve the response rate. I would suggest a tiered plan if you are casting a wide net. For large companies, see if you know someone who knows the hiring manager or the hiring manager itself. But either ways, this person should be a person who, who is able to advocate for you. And if you do, then reach out to this person first. Networking is not a direct substitute for online application. Networking is something that fulfills a much broader purpose. You do not just get to meet people, but you learn a lot and it kind of opens up your mind. So carve out a plan and schedule to make use of both of these avenues. In the upcoming videos, I'm going to talk about what's the right approach when you're applying online and how to maximize the responses. So do come back and thanks for watching.